In a lake full of colourful water lilies and tall reeds lived a frog named Sapualdo. He was distinct from the other frogs, for he had an exceptional talent. He could sing like no other frog in the lake. One full moon night, while all the other frogs croaked, Sapualdo opened his mouth and out poured a smooth and captivating melody. All the frogs halted and listened in awe. They had never heard anything so beautiful. The frogs applauded, fish leaped in the water, and even dragonflies danced to the rhythm of his music. It was a performance none of the pond dwellers had experienced before. The following day, Sapaldo woke up to a crowd of animals around his lake. They all wished to hear him sing again. A little embarrassed, Sapaldo cleared his throat and began to sing. His musical notes vibrated in the air, spreading joy all around the lake. Hearing the lovely song of the frog, a mouse named Mausewaldo approached. Mausualdo praised Sapualdo's talent, suggesting that he should share his gift with the world, but Sapualdo was unsure if his singing would be accepted outside his lake. He was just a simple frog with an unusual skill. However, Mausualdo reassured him that his talent was extraordinary and he should never hide it. Motivated by Mausualdo's words, Sapualdo decided to venture beyond his comfort zone. He waved goodbye to the lake's inhabitants and set off on his journey, Musaldo by his side. They journeyed to the nearby forest where Sapualdo sang to the woodland creatures. They were mesmerized with his enchanting voice, just like the lake inhabitants. News of the singing frog spread throughout the forest. Animals from different corners came to hear Sapualdo's melodious tunes. Next, they travelled to the distant mountains where Sapualdo sang for the mountain goats and eagles. His voice echoed through the valleys, captivating everyone around. As they journeyed, Sapualdo discovered a love for adventure. He enjoyed meeting new creatures and was thrilled to make them happy with his music. Their adventures weren't always calm. They encountered storms and predators and there were times when Sapualdo missed his quiet lake, but Mosualdo always encouraged him. They became an inseparable pair, the singing frog and his loyal mouse friend. Together they faced challenges, spreading joy and music wherever they went. One day, they found themselves in a large city, surrounded by tall buildings and noisy vehicles. It was a chaotic environment, unlike anything they'd seen before. Sapualdo hesitated, wondering if anyone in the city would enjoy his songs. But with a nod from Masewaldo, he took a deep breath and began to sing. His enchanting melodies spilled into the bustling streets, capturing the attention of the busy city dwellers. They stopped, listened and eventually smiled, forgetting their hassles momentarily. Word spread about the singing frog and crowds gathered. Their faces lit up with joy as they listened to Sapualdo. He became a sensation, his music soothing the restless city guests. After the city, Sapualdo and Mausualdo travelled to many more places, from sandy beaches to snow-capped mountains. They met new creatures and Sapualdo's music reached new audiences. Alone, Sapualdo might have remained an ordinary frog in his lake. But with Mausualdo, he discovered his potential and shared his music with the world. They understood that everyone has a unique gift. It just takes a bit of courage to share it, and in doing so, they can touch others' lives in ways they never imagined. Sapualdo's journey taught him that his talent was indeed a gift. A gift that could bring people together, make strangers smile and spread positivity in the world. Whether in his lake, the forest, the mountains or the busy city streets, Sapualdo's music resonated with all. His song spoke a universal language understood by every creature. And so the adventures of the singing frog and his faithful mouse friend continued. They journeyed from place to place, touching lives with music and taking one day at a time.
As they ventured onwards, they left behind a trail of joyous tunes and cherished memories. Sapohaldo's music lingers on, even to this day, in the hearts of those who heard him sing.